won't stop till I get what's mine. Uh. Looking in these devil's faces, I just stare him in the eye with no hesitation. They can What's going on, guys? Your boy Rob Lee back here with another video, bro. Um, so yeah, I'm a. This is not gonna be a reaction video. So this was going to be a reaction video. I was going to do a reaction to the riots, to the Minneapolis situation. Um, and honestly, bro, like I didn't even want to watch the video. Like I already just from, you know. The pictures and shit already knew what the fuck happened. Um, but I actually decided to watch the video and it was a hundred times worse than I imagined that it, it, it was. Like, here's the thing, like when it comes to these, these police situations, I don't like to compare other situations to one situation because every situation is unique in its own way. And the problem is when you actually this is this is the worst of them all in my opinion. This is the worst of them all that I've ever seen. And it maybe it's because we actually saw what happened. And things are amplified when you see things happen. Like, for example, like the NFL when it comes to domestic abuse situations, like a lot of players got domestic abuse situations, but the one player that got the biggest hit of them all was Ray Rice because we saw, no pun intended, we saw the action. We saw it, and when you see it, yes, it enrages you even more. Anything else, if you don't see it, and it could be, it's, it's, it's merely speculation. We don't know, we, you just don't know what happened. I mean, you can have a great idea what happened, you, you know, what's the best chance of this happening and that happened, but you just don't know. This right here, though, you know, we saw what happened. We saw what happened. We don't have to really talk too much about it, but we are, yo. So, um, first, the, you know, that's, I, I think it's just one. I saw I saw a shorter version of the video. I saw a longer. It was a different angle. I don't know if it was two cameras. I think it was the same camera. So, apparently, the dude was resisting arrest. And uh, they they probably rushed, they probably wrestled with this guy probably for 10 minutes. Who knows? Um how long they've been doing it. And another thing I'll preface too is that, another thing I'll preface too is that a lot of times we don't see the full video. Like, you know, the media always, they're gonna pick and choose what they wanna put out. And we even pick and choose what we're gonna be enraged about in general. So um, when you see videos of things happening, they don't show this full video. And then once they show the full video, you get a better idea of what happened. In this situation, I don't care what the fuck happened before um, the thing that happened. It, it it was clearly, everything that happened in this video was unnecessary. Let's get into it real quick. So, you know, he pulls the camp, the, the, he, come, he comes in and he, the guy has, the, the cop has his knee on the dude's neck. And the dude is saying, I can't breathe, I can't breathe. And at that point, he's already in handcuffs, he's already down. Uh, and it just it just doesn't look good. It's like why you still got your knee on this dude's neck and all the people around. First of all, his his how it's even worse than what you guys even probably think. One of the people in the crowd, one of the guys, the main guy actually that was the most vocal, he said he was in the police academy. He's he's trained in the in the academy and he's telling them. This is not protocol, blah, 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 basically. There's another person in the crowd who is a firefighter slash paramedic. And she's telling them that the dude can't breathe. The guy's screaming that he can't breathe. You got a, 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 um, a person that was inspired to be a cop telling you that you're doing it wrong. Um, and you have a potential paramedic um, slash fighter fighter who is telling you that you're doing something wrong. And, and you know, I, and, and even when it comes to, you know, claiming people, I, I, I'm always like, you know, when people say, hey, this is racist, that is racist, I'm always the type of, it's like, you know, let, let's look at more into it and see if it's really racism. This shit right here, clearly racism, not even on the officer's part, the officer that was, you know, doing the action. It was the other officer. The other officer with all the different 
you know, oh, he must, be, he must be a crackhead, oh, he's overdosed, all this bullshit that he was spewing, that, I, I think that cop, in my opinion, I'm, I'm, I feel, you know, worse about him than I feel about the cop, because one, he didn't do anything, he's not listening, he's just, you know, controlling the crowd, you know, and then he's coming up with all these different um, slurs and, and shit that he's saying, and I'm just like, what the fuck is going on, yo? And they're, they're like literally telling you, like, yo, you're crushing this dude's neck. The dude, he's like, oh, he can still talk, so he must be breathing. Are you fucking retarded? <laughs> like, are you, and I'm not, and, you know, I'm not laughing. I'm just, I'm like, this shit is the worst shit I've ever seen. And, you know, like, rioting and stuff. Not gonna solve the problem, you know. I seen that's why I was gonna actually take this video the direction of this video too. But fuck it, fuck it, do that shit because that was the worst I've ever seen. That was the worst that I've ever seen. Like that's that's insane, bro. Insane. And like I said, I want to focus just on this situation. It's just. Put every situation in its own box, and this one was just beyond out of control. Like, but yeah, rest in peace to George Floyd. Condolences to his family. Hope y'all get justice. Everybody, you know, here's the thing too. Like, you know, it's it's a due process. Everybody's like, oh, they only got fired. What do you mean they only got fired? This they this is the fastest. This is how you know it's the worst because the the department responded. The way they should always respond initially. You can't say, oh, they only got fired. No, they, they didn't only get fired. There's going to be a trial. You got to wait. This, this is how the thing things work. So be patient. You know, there's no fucking way that that cop doesn't go to jail. There's no way. There's no way. But yeah, yo, um, that's basically it, man. I just wanted to, like, this this video was going to be take a whole other direction, but I definitely had to had to actually get it. I'm glad I watched the video because I was able to get a different perspective of everything. And this, this is the, this is outrage. This is outraging. Like, very outraging. Um, like, in freaking sane. Can't believe it, man. Anyway, guys, peace out.